Hey everybody, welcome to my usual me, and welcome back to Last Oasis. All right, guys, if you are not familiar with how to get pearls, I'm going to show you how to get pearls today. They're super easy to grab, but they are kind of few in number. So what you want to do, guys, is right off the bat, you're going to want to find these centerpieces right here. Not the not the not the canyons, not the not the chasms, um, not not these savanna areas, and not the desert. You actually want normally they're in the center of a tile. And they look like this, and they have little water, little water pools in here. And you're probably going to need a spider walker to get in there because uh, any they have large rocks that are scattered around, and it makes it really hard for a large walker to get in. So we're going to go ahead, and I'm going to take, I'm not, I'm going to leave my dinghy behind, and I've, I'm borrowing a, I'm borrowing an armored spider from somebody uh, here at the the larger base, one of the larger bases. And so we're going to go ahead, and we're going to head on out, and I'm going to head down to one of these pools. We're going to see if we can give ourselves some pearls. I already have what I need, but I wanted to show you where to find these things so you can make your life a little bit easier. Okay, guys. Now, once you go and you get to the edge of this thing, let me go ahead and just get it on the map real quick. Once we get to the edge of this thing, we're going to want to go in and get, find, get into these pools right here. So you got to find a, a way in, which it's not always easy, but I think, this is, I, think I found a, a way in. So I think we're going to be fine. Once we get to the pools, I'll show you exactly what you need to look for. And there's more than one spot where you can find pearls it's not just in the water but they also you can also find them in the sand as well all right your first location you're going to find these pearls down in here is going to be in the white sands and if you look right here you can see these shells let me go to first person you can see these shells right here and it'll say harvest you can go ahead and just harvest them much like that you get one pearl a piece you don't get a lot they are scattered uh quite a bit around but they're not too they're not super thick so you only get one pearl a piece when you harvest these guys by hand um i do listen, we're going to test out and see if i can harvest them with with a pick and get more let's see i've got let's see i've got a pick right here let me go ahead and see if i can if i can harvest them with a pick i cannot harvest them with a pick how about a hatchet that looks like a negative and how about we try a scythe we'll try a scythe I don't, I don't know why you'd be able to harvest them with a scythe. No, I believe you have to harvest them by hand. You only get one pearl apiece. But you're going to be able to find, and remember, guys, you're, you're only going to be able to find them in these type of locations right here that look like this. So now let's go ahead and head over to the water, and I'll show you what you need to look for there, too. All right, it looks like we have an enemy base over here to our right, so we're going to go ahead, not an enemy base, but we have a, a, somebody else's base over there. It's not our guys, so it's not on, our, it's not on my map, so it's somebody else's. But in the water as well, guys, it's going to be a little bit harder to see, but they're going to look like exactly the same. So there's the, uh, and you also when you go and you mouse over it, you'll see collect. That'll collect the water. But if you use your mouse wheel and you can, har you can scroll it, that'll go into the harvest, and then you can harvest your pearl. So anytime that you come up against something and it's not, it doesn't look like you're going to be able to harvest it, see if you can move your mouse wheel back and forth. And see if you can go ahead and harvest whatever you're trying to harvest. So that might make your life a little bit easier. These pearls are a little bit harder to see because of the water. So... But they are they are definitely harvestable. So you get it in the sand, you get it in the water. Um, like I said, you only get one a piece. But fortunately, the armor that we're looking to make, I'm looking to make, is going to be the triple stitch armor. And so they the the triple stitch bracers take pearl and cotton and repu vine, and and well the triple stitch armor itself takes rope and nomad cloth. But the uh, boots and the bracers. Those are actually going to take pearl and cotton. Now, cotton you're going to find on on the hard zones. So I'm going to show you how to do that in a in a separate video because this video wasn't about making this triple stitch armor. It was just about where to find the pearls. So we're going to get to that in another video, guys. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Hope you learned something. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do that right now. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you, and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.